Hello, uh, my name is David Danikin. I am an associate professor uh, in history at the, the Department of History and Philosophy at Austin Peay State University. Uh, and um, today I'll describe this um, event that is going to take place on Saturday, February the 19th, uh, between 9 a.m. and 4 p.m. Uh, breakfast, lunch, and uh, snacks will be available and uh, those in attendance will get a chance to see um, what it's like to be a history and philosophy major for a day. Uh, there will be some activities and uh, workshops for prospective students, um, for parents, and uh, for teachers. Um, additionally, uh, students uh, can choose to participate in a research scholarship competition for the opportunity to win a $1,000 scholarship. Uh, to participate, students must submit a, um, an original 800 to 1200 word essay that answers um, either the philosophy or the history prompt. Uh, the essay must have three parts. Um, it should have the title page, uh, the essay itself, and also a bibliography or a works cited. Uh, and also for more details, um, please refer to the History and Philosophy website at uh, apsu.edu slash history dash and dash philosophy. Students will answer one of two prompts. Um, so here is the philosophy prompt. Is there objective moral truth or is the morality of any action relative to individual preference or social convention? Define your terms and defend your thesis um, with arguments. And here is the history prompt. Um, in his book, Reflections on the Revolution in France, Edmund Burke states, quote, People will not look forward to posterity who never look backward to their ancestors, end quote. Uh, what does this quote mean to you? Uh, how relevant is the study of history in today's world? Uh, use specific historical examples to prove your argument. So we look uh, forward to seeing you and thank you.